Welcome back to Breath of Fire 2. Now, the last episode, we went through this maze thing. And now we have to fight this wall. You can't fight a wall. You can only lean on it. Please enter your password. Punch it. Your time is up. We start attacking. We? Is it more than one? It's not a wall, it's a portal. Ah, my mistake. You are a mistake, Yes, Gene, attack yourself. You called him Gene. Yes, Gene, attack yourself. Gene's not even here. <laughs> Gene's a Gene. Gene got replaced by the grass man. I'd rather have Gene right now. <laughs> Fire. Ball! Is he... I healed it. I healed it. Fire, the fireball healed it? I guess you can't use magic on it. You know what else you can't use magic on? This is going to be a really dumb long battle. You know what else you can't use magic on? Your face. A Yu-Gi-Oh tournament. <laughs> Magic's banned. They have spell cards now. <laughs> what, what are you doing? This guy has 1,600 HP. Is he really, like, invulnerable to magic? Is that is that actually how it goes? It doesn't say anything about that. Oh, it says, just keep attacking with normal attacks and you'll be fine. So I guess so, huh? Except for oh, Spar. Yeah. Go, Grassman. You know, you know why Grassman's not very effective against that? What? Walls can't get high, man. <laughs> walls can't do the marijuana. I thought it'd be good because <laughs> walls are, are part of the system and um, Spar is against the system. system. <laughs> No, it doesn't work like that. Nothing works like that. <laughs> Punch that wall. You don't have a very good party for this. You have exactly two characters that deal damage. I know. <laughs> it did a special. Spar did a special. For one. It should be illegal for a character to be so bad. Like, jeez. Dude, don't be over there yawning. That's not that's not cool. You're not cool. You don't have to tell everyone. Jeez, Michael. Not not Stan. What will we do without him? This is the one battle I actually need him for. This is going to take forever. Yes, it is. But it doesn't seem like this fight is difficult at all. It's just going to take forever. There's going to be 20 minutes of us beating on this wall. We're going to break the wall down. Gotta break the establishment down. Gonna burn the cities. Then we're gonna... We're gonna defeat the... The leader. The general. I think that's what they call her, right? The, the general? Yes. Yeah, the general. Take down her and her empire of crappy car insurance. That's <laughs> just to, <laughs> to make that joke. <laughs> yeah. Go to the general and save some time! <laughs> I can't remember the first part of it, but there you go. For a great low rate you can get online, go to the general and save some time! Please don't. <laughs> Please don't go to the general, people. <laughs> don't save time. <laughs> the only thing you'll do is give, the, give anyone you hit nightmares for weeks. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, you have the general... <laughs> This wall. <sighs> it's so that Stern's our fastest party member, so I have to use him to heal. But he's also our most damage dealing member of our group in this battle. Yeah. 
Yep. It's dead. We did it. The force field has been canceled. So has your show. Look at him freaking out over there in the corner. He stopped. Look at him walking. This is the control room. If we can destroy the control room, we can keep the castle from turning into a weapon. These dudes again. What a bunch of jokers. I'm not cool enough to say that line. But you know who is? A guy named Ryan. What? It's from Xenoblade, man. Oh. What a bunch of jokers. Hey, Michael. Yeah. Can I ask you a question? Are you feeling it? Mr. Krabs. <laughs> want to know if I'm feeling it? <laughs> yeah! I want to know if you're feeling it. I'll tell you what I'm feeling. Don't be yawning over there, man. I got a collar and a tooling. Whoa, dude. Um, go on my phone over here. I, I see something. I see an interesting news topic. What? Well, it's an article. It says local man really feeling it. <laughs> <laughs> looks like uh, looks like Shulk. I didn't know it was around here. Are you ready, princess? This machine takes the strength of, a hu of the human heart. Well, well, wait just a minute. Yeah, I thought they were monkeys. These are monkeys. If we feed your strong feelings of dedication to this country, this castle will surely be revived. I order you to kill me! I would prefer to die than to be used for something like this. Say, say, that's not very ladylike. El Foran. Stan! Ha, huh, so you have appeared just as I thought. I'll kill you in front of the princess. Her feelings of sadness will be the chain changed into a very strong energy. Pay attention, princess. Match the man you love. Die right before your eyes. This is Shupke. Shupuke. Shupuke. What? What's with them in the extra letters now? <laughs> she has nine hundred and fifty. Nine hundred and fifty HPs. Eight, eight, eight paws. Dude, that's a lot of, lot of, lot of computers. <laughs> she has just sitting around her house. Not doing much of anything. Except shooping them around, being a shoopuke. Shoopuke, bruh. Hush. Fear puppy. That doesn't seem like the most effective one. One. <laughs> Just one. Just one weed. Just one. See, that's the problem with, with uh, Spar. He only wants to give away a singular one. A singular weed. Yeah, he's kind of stingy for someone called the Grass Man. Looks like he has his hands on quite a stash, too, so maybe he's not the best guy after all. Hush. 
special. Blocked? How, what? How do you block a healing spell? <laughs> yeah. Why would you block a healing? Like, I, I mean, like I, I guess, I guess the enemy blocks it. I guess. But like, uh, how? I mean, they're kind of far apart. <laughs> He's like, no, in my house. <laughs> no healing item. No healing spells ever. You're nuzlocking this game, remember? One. One singular weed. Refresh is really good. It is. But you know what's even better? Nate, call of nature. Yeah. Call of nature. <laughs> call of the wild. Uh, tooth and nail. Oh, a Sega controller. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty sure you can hear that. Because, like, now I'm really aware of, like, all the background noise. And I'm not sure if it's this bad in the actual recordings. But, jeez. If it is, man, I feel really sorry. Dude, I stole 30 AP from him. Yeah, but it only ever it only ever irks. only ever works once. It only ever irks, it only ever irks once. Dude, special. Did you see that special? I saw that. His special is the same as his... Uh, Normal attack. You know why? Because Spar is always special. <laughs> Spar is like borderline... Not even borderline. Spar is just useless. Maybe once we go to the next town and get some items. Get some more weapons. So you didn't have to have Spar with you here is the thing. I know. We could have we could have been sparless, but she was like, "No, we need spar because uh, because uh, you know we need a little more. we gotta be able to spar in the next part." I do a really good Michael impression. I know <laughs> it's perfect. I know I sound just like you. They'll be wondering if you were actually the one saying that. Oh, uh, Jaden Yugi is in Fire Emblem Fates. What? There's this guy that says every time he defeats an enemy, an enemy he says absolutely flawless. I don't get it. Have you never watched GX in your life? Yes. Literally, that's all EJ says. I don't recall. <laughs> absolutely flawless. He doesn't say absolutely, but he just says flawless. <laughs> flawless. You know what else is flawless? My fate. Your grass man. Grass man's. Grass man. Grass man's ability to fight. Grass man is the only man that matters. Man, if you don't know grass man, you I ain't did it. nobody. Uh, what you did? I stole, oh, I stole again. Did you just get drained? Yeah, Spar did. He doesn't need it. It didn't even take the AP away, did it? Uh, I don't think so. It might have. I don't think I've used any of his AP. There we go. <laughs> 20k. The XP almost. Bob moved to level 20. What? Oh, you. I will turn all of my anger and hatred into energy. I will at least accomplish the arrival of the flying castle. This castle will turn to a flying fortress. 
and the world will bow between us. Between us? You mean between before us. us. Oh, it's a barrier! I said I would stop it, but I'm not very good with technical stuff. That's how you fix the computer, guys. You just jump on it. Sure. We're not cavemen. We have technology. <laughs> That's been like the fifth <laughs> SpongeBob references episode. <laughs> Did they have to make this thing so sturdy? I think he turned it on. Stop. Stop it. Please stop. Huh? Who's that? Who messed with the switch on the control room? The energy is going backwards. If we want to do something, it'll explode. Pop. Oh, you're dead. We're in trouble. We've got to get out of here. That just split like... I like how it's jagged in the back. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Look, it's, it's like perfect in the front, and then in the back it's just... Buildings collapse like that. You learned ah. it here. <laughs> you saw it here first. Someone must move the... Elevator. Everyone, get into the elevator with the princess. Stan! Princess, please go quickly. Everybody, I'm counting on you to protect the princess. They're like, okay, we're going. I understand. Then until we meet again. If we meet again. Goodbye, Stan. Aw, snap. It just got PG up in here. <laughs> A foreign. The Stin dead? Yep. Stin's dead. Is. Is Stin still missing? Uh, well. Princess, Stin is the man who survived the Battle of Guttenham. I'm sure he is fine this time as well. You're probably right. I apologize for the inconvenience we caused you. Please accept this famous flute. Hemo obtained the famous flute. In exchange for loaning you this flute, I have a request to make. Should that smooth-talking young Highlander man appear before you again, please tell him this. Take care of yourself. Don't overdo it. And I hope that someday... Please watch over him. May the grace of the Dragon God be with you. I'll walk you to the exit. Let's go. It's hard to see the woman I love look so sad. The princess really does love Stan. What a drag. He always gets the good one. Good ones. Nope, good one. He always gets that one good one. Shall we go? Robbie, who's that? Look who it is! Who's that, Robbie? It's, uh, Stanley? It, it's, it's Stan's brother, Stan. 
<laughs> I knew you were alive. Yeah. Looks like I failed to die again. There's no looks like. There's a lot of words that you add or leave <laughs> out, and I decided I wanted to add that on purpose. Gunham was very hard. Yeah. Everybody died. Woolman, Yoan, Selner, they all died there. They were all great guys. They were all good soldiers. Like sharpened knives. Yeah. Don't you die, Sten. The princess and I will be waiting for you. You're a great guy. That was... That was my line. I'll see you around. He just did. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. I've caused you all such inconveniences. You see, I'm an ex-soldier, so I'm not very good with things. <laughs> Shall we go? Look at that smooth grab. Now we have the famous flute. We can go back to Tulan and actually understand what those people are saying. Tulan! It's Tune Local um, Something Network. Local. Um, word. Our queen is terrible. She is so spoiled, she always makes things difficult for others. Reminds you of someone. Me? Yourself. I knew you were going there. No, I was talking about the NPC. She's spoiled. Oh. Okay, well, whatever whatever you say. I mean, Robbie, look. With your, your let's play too. Look, Robbie. It goes from 57 to 77. Whack. WP. His IVWP. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I bought him a new weapon. Maybe he can do three. You could have, you could have bought that before. Okay. No wonder he was terrible. <laughs> but you know what? Now he's only going to hit for two. <laughs> I was about to say, maybe he can hit for three now. Huh. That's a problem. Is there anything we can do to cure her illness? Yeah, you can get out of my to <laughs> Please stop. Grass, ma'am. It's like, what, four episodes later and I'm still talking about The Legend of Grassman. <laughs> Just rename all the videos. <laughs> the Legend of Grassman. Grassman <laughs> no, starting from that part, it's like Breath of Fire part whatever slash uh, The Legend of Grassman. Grassman one. The, the Legend of the Legendary Grassman. The queen is very, very overweight. She can no longer move. If she doesn't lose some weight, she will die. People, please save the queen. All right, God. God, save the queen. I'm so hungry. My body feels so heavy. People, save the queen. I hate to admit it, but only... I read that as God at first. I hate to I hate to admit it, but only God can cure the queen of her obesity. They're they're all gonna talk the same way, because they all look the same. Old man Gad was fired because he has a temper and has no respect for women. According to rumors, he was banished to a small island. Wait a second. Is it the whale guy? No, that's not him. Uh, Cause he didn't have a name. He was just Grandpa or something, wasn't he? Gramps, something like that. A whale. A whale's name is Grandpa. I know the whale, but they, they the dolphins was calling the yeah. He the started, dude. started with an M. Oh, it did like, he had a name? Like, I didn't know really he actually like had Miyamoto. a name. Miyamoto. I don't yeah. think that was it at all. Let's see what what uh, he can hit for. He's a powering up his bow beam. Forty. <laughs> it's like Spar is a real character now. <laughs> Impressive. I mean, 
Blue can almost do as much damage. Yeah, melee. but look at the level. Look at the level difference. Look at the level difference. Uh, 26, 36, 20, 26. It's Gramps. Grandpa. My whale, buddy. We have to look for a small island. Have we found it yet? Can I let you in on a little secret? Yes, we have. What? You're a small island. Your face is a small island. So... Is the island lonely? No. Because I like lonely islands. I'm sure you do. Really. You're also making like making lame jokes. No, none of my jokes are lame. You're just jealous that you didn't come up with them. You're you're totes right. Look, this li this island is lonely. There's nothing around it. Is this the place? Yes. I think we need the to cave see. of the legendary old man. Yes. There he is. What do you want? Do you need me for something? I don't have time to listen to your stories. If you want to talk about pretty girls, we can talk all night. Ah, so he's that old man, huh? It's Master Roshi. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Maybe uh, he only wants to talk to pretty girls. She's a half snake. See if uh, see if a uh, spar does anything. For Spar's him. a man. Shh, he doesn't have to know that. He does. He's on to us. So we have to go get cat or Nina, because apparently he's discriminating. Apparently, blue's not hot enough. I mean, look at that. She's <laughs> winking. She's also immortal. What else could you want? She's also basically a god. I mean. It's the, to it's the total package. Yeah, the total package if you're into snakes. Snake demigods that can live outlive you. I'm a snakey snake. <laughs> I'm a snakey little snake. <laughs> I am the worst person. So we're still not done with Spar yet, are we? Yes. I mean, for now. For now? We haven't gone through anywhere that required... Uh... Yeah, we did. We, we talked to that one tree. Oh, uh, yeah, we did talk to the tree, didn't we? Uh, let's see. Our party's going to be blue, um, ran, and cat. Blue cheese. See you later, Sten. It was fun while it lasted. It, it wasn't. It was very, very painful. You know what else is very, very painful? Uh, uh, me hitting you in the face. You don't have to hit me in the face. Someone else already took care of that earlier this week. Who hit you in the face? I can't reveal that information on, uh, on, uh, on video, man. They were confined you? I don't know. Maybe. You finished the job? I don't mean it was it was an accident, but it still happened. Uh -huh. You know, I don't want to sell anyone out that you know isn't named Michael. It was David, wasn't it? No, I haven't seen him since November. <laughs> He's a scrub. Oh, you remember when we were gonna make David a mythical figure on the show? We we already are. Well, you see, the other day I talked to him for the first time in a long time, and. He was like, hey, maybe we can hang out this weekend. And I was like, well, actually, Michael and I are kind of recording for the show. And he was like, oh, that's cool. And I go, yeah, you know, you're a total, you're a totally a mythical figure on the show. And he's like, LOL, what? And I'm just like, yeah, dude, the fans totally love you. And he's like, they do? And I'm like, yeah, man, we're going to need to have you on the show sometime. Everyone's really excited to see, to actually meet you. David's not allowed. <laughs> I mean, I'm I'm totally messing with him. That's the point. Where's the? And you know what the best part is? He's literally never going to watch this. He's never going to hear this. Yeah. Here we go. I, I got back. I'm 
by pretty girls he means he means ran like <laughs> what if only Nina works I will hit something cause I mean you know cat is she's got half cat I mean but she she wears no pants 24 7 yeah but that just means there's less left to the imagination anyways I guess we'll see if he finds Cat to his liking on the next episode. All Rand. Yes, or Rand. I I, I have quite the take in the <laughs> Rand. <laughs> All right. Anyways, thanks for watching. Be sure to check us out on the next episode of Radical Game Guys. We always end it on a battle. Yeah, we do. That's how you do it, man.